What's up ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, this is Marlon Quateris here, the creator of Marlinology, and this is Marlinology 5, Season 43. Playing Marlinology Games 10, Valiant Hearts, The Great War, and uh, so you know that uh, this week, October 3rd to October 7th, 2016, I will be doing twice a day for only this week, 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. per day, Eastern Standard Time. So I hope uh, you enjoy uh, this season, and uh, hopefully you can feel free to comment, like, subscribe, and share legally this video and many other of my works, and enjoy. What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? This is Marlon Quateros here, the creator of Marlonology, and this is episode 424 of Marlonology Games 10, playing uh, Valiant Hearts The Great War. And of course, uh, this happens to be season 43. Of course, playing as Anna right now. Anna had to uh, move to Paris uh, because uh, there was, the Germans uh, are holding their position in, of course, uh, like Belgium. Of course, so uh, right now Anna is uh, going downstairs. Yeah, I heard someone calling right now, as in uh, like you know in the game. Taxis to the Mar Parisian taxis are requisitioned. Yeah. <clears throat> so if you want to read the history, uh, like you know the facts, feel free to pause the video uh, to take your time. Uh, take your time to like read it. Of course, uh, there's the Germans at the gate. Oh my God. Taxi to the Mar. The Germans at the gate, yeah, they did not like you know take over the Eiffel the Eiffel Tower until 1940, which Hitler like uh, came uh, like I believe like 16 no 26 years later, which you'll probably find out like for those of you uh, like the uh, who haven't uh, like you know, known about World War Two yet. So of course I know spoiler alert, yeah, history. But for those of you who already know, yeah, you already know, yeah. No need, no need to explain. Okay, of course, uh, like I need a good wrench, and that as well. Oh crap! Yeah, I'm gonna grab this, and uh, no, nah, not wrong one. Yeah, yeah, this, yeah, I believe this is the right one. Yeah, perfect, perfect. Now I'm gonna need uh, like a bucket. Oh crap! Little girl, uh, like ended up. Uh, getting herself injured. I mean, it's not much of an injury, but still. Yeah, I believe it's a minor cut. Yeah, it's a minor cut. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Okay. So. Alright. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Okay. Yeah. So, Wiguchi. Yeah, of course. Heart meaning thank you. It's finally, a little French girl like can uh, like be free from any more injuries as long as she's safe, like not in enemy territory. Okay, so got an empty uh, like glass of water. Need that for no, no. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah, finally. Like I cooled the uh, like I cooled off the engine. Of course, I need a different wrench right now. Yeah, this is the one. Yep, that's the one. That's the one. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. We fixed it. Now, the French, the Parisians, are on their way toward the battlefield. Toward the French-Belgian border. Oh, this is going to be, like, crazy. Oh, man. Oh. Gotta be careful. Oh man! Oh shit! I ended up uh, colliding with the freaking uh, like you know, statue over there. Oh crap! So yeah, the Parisian taxis. Uh, of course, uh, like if I were to go back in time, it'd be like, wow! Oh my god! Serious. Oh man, the barrels. That was close. Of 
that's like the first time ever like uh, like an entire like uh, army of uh, Parisian taxis uh, started to uh, like uh, carry uh, like you know French soldiers uh, to the front lines <coughs> yeah oh crap yeah they, they they're way too close oh shit yeah this is really bad oh man more barrels that's just by it Seriously, wow. Ooh, damn, that's dangerous. That was close. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, man. Seriously, come on. Now, it's on to the battlefield right now. September 7th, 1914, towards the Battle of the Marne. First Battle of the Marne, actually. I mean, I don't know the exact date. I forgot to check, but uh, you, you don't need to know. If you if you really want to know, you can uh, like look up online like you know two bat two battles of the Marne. You know, first one in 1914, and I believe 1916 or 19. 19- oh man, yeah, someone needs help. I'm gonna pull this uh, soldier out. Come on, here we go. Of course, he needs assistance. I'm gonna give him assistance. Here we go. Okay. Oh. Yep. Yep. All right. Of course, we're not done yet. Oh, here we go. Oh yeah. Okay. One more. Oh yeah. Now, time to heal it up. Okay. Properly elevated and rest, but you know what they say. I heard that like in health class uh, during high school, like back in high school, like like in health class, or I believe in gym class, like yeah, we were like you know told about like this thing called rice. You know, rest, ice, compress, elevate. You know, meaning just lay uh, like uh, the just lay the injured like lay the injured limb right there. Like at a at a place uh, like you know where it doesn't move too much. Now ice it, like you know, so that uh, you know you end up like you're know, relieving like you know, the tension, and then compress it like you know which is also warm. Yeah, apparently like you know, there's a oh man wow oh my god so many men are wounded. Well, they really need me. Of course, I'm gonna unlock the diary now. Yeah. Okay, so pause the video if you wanna like uh, check the diaries. Like I don't have time, I like to read all of them. I just wanna like focus on the game. Okay. See, so, yeah, I gotta get Carl. Like, I don't know, for some reason, like, you know, when I watch The Walking Dead, like, yeah, you know, I'm just, uh, like, used to hearing or used to saying Coral, like, even though his name is Carl. <laughs> no, you know, it, it happened, like, you know, someone, someone just said it, you know, hey, Coral, Coral, <laughs> like, I know, I know it's Carl, but it's, it sounded more like Coral, okay, so, yeah. Of course, the heck the bomb. Feel free to read that by pausing the video. Yeah, yeah, wounded. Yeah, nurses. Oh yeah, many people back then called nurses angels. Yeah, they like fell in love uh, with the uh, like the nurses just right away. You know, for helping them. I mean, that's, uh, it's typical. Okay, so this guy needs uh, to be amputated. Like, one of his limbs definitely needs an amputation. Okay. Oh, man. I gotta shut up. Oh, man. Okay, time for the amputation. Oh, yeah. I mean, it'd be more appropriate for Anastasia. Okay, yeah, I believe, uh, like, should be good. 
I mean, at least he's safe from dying from a bacterial infection. Too bad, uh, like, you know, back then, like, uh, you had to saw to amputate the limbs. I know, it's really ridiculous. <sighs> you know. I mean, let's just say that I learned, uh, like, you know, the Civil War. Oh, trust me. Like, amputation was brutal. Like, then World War... No, actually, World War Two. I'm pretty sure, like, you know, they learned a lot, like, you know, during... Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure during World War Two, everything, like, had... Uh, everything had, uh, like, you know... Imp like, drastically, like, improved... Like, uh, technologically and medically. Okay, so... I'm running towards... It. No, no, I'm here to pick this up. <coughs> okay. I know uh, that is a cross. Okay, so that person needs my assistance. Alright, here we go. Alright. Stage two. Round two. Round three. Okay. Yeah, we should be good. No problem. But, doesn't mean it's over. <laughs> yeah. So apparently this guy, uh, like, needs, uh, like, a cross to, like, of course, uh, like, you know, bury this guy and, like, you know, put his... But the soldier's name, like you know, the one who died. No need to explain any further. All right. Here's your tombstone cross. Rest in peace. Oh wait, yeah, I can't forget about this. Yeah, the shovel. Like you know, someone needs it. Like you know, to walk. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, dude. I know you're dehydrated. Okay, so basically that guy like got his uh, like a shovel to be used as a as a cane or not not as a like a crutch or crutches. I mean, it's stupid at least, you know, to say like crutch like sounded like crotch. I know, I know, an appropriate joke. I mean, I don't often like, you know use inappropriate jokes here. But anyway, but anyway, the guy needed a cane, and of course, I'm getting the water right now. And the guy needs the water right now because he's so dehydrated. So here you go. All right. So apparently, there's another person who. Yep, that's the person. Oh crap! I can't believe he ended up in a pile of filth. A pile of shit, literally. Okay. It's time to, uh, like, aid the soldier. Of course, I know he's German. But that's her job, actually. Of course, to help no matter who it is. Oop. Yep. Yep, that's the town that, that I just mentioned in the previous episode. So the Battle of Yeep has begun. And of course, I know the Battle of Yeep is like, you know, this, like, this place so uh, where well Adolf Hitler like you know once fought like during World War One as a corporal. Of course there are the facts. Yeep, a town in ruins dubbed wipers <laughs> by the British because uh, of due to its uh, difficult pronunciation. The town of wipers uh, was a key strategic position. Okay. So you can read that by pausing the video. Wipers Technology at work. Yeah, of course, uh, like, you know, of course there are new technologies. Franco-Prussian War, like, kind of almost had the same thing Americans had during the Civil War, but I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna bore you, like, you know, with all this. I mean, I know that sounds, uh, like, really, like, historically nerdy of me, 
Like, but of course I am a nerd, but but I'm a different type of nerd. Like, you know, there are different types of nerds out there. Nerds uh, like you know, who uh, like you know, who are obsessed with the weather, like me. Nerds who are obsessed with games, anime. Of course, uh, this lady needs my help. All right, here we go. <clears throat> okay, just uh, need a few more. All right. Okay, time for a drink up. That was kind of pointless, you know, with the water. I mean, I get it. Like, you know, she needed, like, my help. But, like, at least, to, like, you know, take time, I like, to drink water. Don't rush. Yeah, I can't get through. There you go. Your mother is uh, back. Back to normal. Okay, so apparently I got to move on. Seriously? Ah, oh, crap. I can't I can't get through. Yeah. Of course, so there was a key right there. Dubbed wipers. Eep. Like, I'd rather call it Eep because, like, I remember, like, in one documentary, like, they pr actually pronounced it Eepa. Like, I'm pretty sure that, uh, you know, why couldn't, uh, like, you know, they mention, uh, like, you know, Hitler, like, you know, being, uh, like, you know, in the battle, in the battle of Eep because, like, the reasons because he fought there, you know, fought there until he was uh, like attacked by poison gas, mustard gas. Yeah, I know. Like, yeah, I, I watch a lot of uh, like you know one of those World War Two documentaries. Ah, oh, come on, it has to be the right place. Ah, uh, yeah, that's not good. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's much better. Okay. There we go. Got to fix on um, that one as, uh, as well. Nope. It's, yeah, that. There, there we go. Okay, time to bang that bell. Hit that bell. Yes! Okay, there we go. Alright, time to get that uh, large cog. Yeah, there we go. Now it's time to press. Time to ring the bell. Yeah, there we go. Oh man! Oh man, that was heavy. Oh, that was poor. Like, oh, that was that was terrible. You yeah, know the pathway. And what do you know? Looks like uh, like those who were trapped can finally get the fuck out. All right, it's time to head downstairs. Ah, oh, finally, fresh air. Oh, but that guy uh, needs help because, uh, like, he breathed that poison gas. I believe it was mustard gas or chlorine. All right, time to heal this person up. Why in the leg? Okay, here we go. Oh, oh yeah, I know hurts yeah but what can you do anyway like you should be uh, like fine yeah let me pick this up okay on the gas uh, like uh, exited it's time to oh right yeah I already pulled the uh, lever it's time to head back and head outside and hopefully uh, like that poison gas uh, isn't uh, like still ah oh, it's still there god damn fucking shit 
what the fuck do I do now? I wonder if I'm supposed to go here. No. Oh, right. I, I forgot. Like, yeah, it's through this way. Damn it. I'm so stupid. All right. Got to keep on moving. Uh-oh. Shit. Of course, the place, uh, like, if you were to go uh, back in time, it stinks like shit. I mean, it's it's like 10,000 to like 100,000 times worse than like freaking like B.O., you know, as in body odor. Yeah, I know you need to get the fuck out. Hold your horses. Just let me like get something for like, you know, me to help you and then I then you can get out. No, not nothing there. OK, it's time to. Uh, oh, OK. Yeah, I guess, uh, like, yeah, the cup is fine. Okay. Yeah, punch that, like, picture. Alright, let's, uh, head downstairs. Let's move on. And, uh... <laughs> funny guy. Yeah, I just saw, like, yeah, a small picture. Like, a uh, guy with glasses. <laughs> funny looking guy. Okay, so basically, like, I am, like, you know, trying to remember the combination. Okay, yeah. Okay, let me try two. All right. Three. Eight. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah. I mean, at first it just came to me, but I sucked. God damn. All right, let's uh, go back up and try to remem rememorize uh, like everything. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so it was six, four, eight. Okay. Six, four, eight. Okay, let's go to four. All right, then six, eight. Yes, there we go. All right, now, oh, yeah, cheering. And what do you know? Look at all these uh, plans these Germans uh, late were implementing. Shit, these Germans are very uh, like clever, like when it comes to like you know new innovations. Okay, grabbed. Uh, the handle, that's good. That's good. Alright. Now it's time to like head up, of course. Now it's time to like make her Uh oh! Oh crap. Oh shit. Oh crap, she's suffocating. I gotta help her. Man, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she just ran in place. Problem is, I can't like I still can't get through that door. All right, what I'm gonna do is uh, like you know, place the handle right there and pull. There we go. And I gotta get one of those uh, German grenades like they used during World War One, of course. Now I gotta throw that like at a place uh, where ship blows up and I believe that I gotta throw at that like rubble over there okay there we go hope, hope that it explodes okay yes now I can get through okay so apparently she still like you know, needs help of course I know poison gas is bad <sighs> okay another round Man, this is tricky. Okay. Hope this one isn't tricky. Okay. Wow. 
wow, that was uh, that was a little trickier than the, like the last. At least, uh, like, yeah, she's feeling better. <sighs> yep, that's how Anna's father, like, yeah, was kidnapped. Because, because Baron von Dorf apparently is a total jackass. Fucking is greedy, like, trying to like, you know, like, take on uh, like the allies. Now they're heading to the rainforest. Oh shit! Yeah, that's the part where we left off, uh, like, from the previous episode. Up, oh, up. Oh. Here we go. Oh my god! I hope uh, they don't die. Oh crap! Ooh man. That is bad. Yeah, I bet, like, yeah, no one, like, had survived, like, the crash. It's a f what the fuck? Oh, I see. Yeah, I'm assuming that, like, uh, these uh, French soldiers don't want women to, uh, like, you know, go to wherever they want, want or need to go. Even if it's an emergency. Good. That's right, Walt. Give him distracted. Crap, I gotta hide in that bush. Shit. I don't like this at all. Oop. Yeah, the guy needs help, so I gotta help this guy out, even though he's German. Okay, that was fast. Oh, man, I skipped it. Oh, my God. Wow. If I'd done worse, that'd be pretty bad. Now. Wow. Oh. Yep. There's that fragment. There's sh in the, you know, the bomb, like, you know, shell bomb fragment, you know. Of course that happens. Uh, you said danke. You know, I mean, you thank you in German. Oh, shit. Yeah, he's busted. Even though, like, even though Anna had to help a, like, German soldier, wounded one, but he's caught. But we don't have a choice. We can't, can't take on, uh, like, the French soldiers. Sexist, uh, like, even though they're still sexist. Okay. Facts here for you guys uh, to feel free to read. Okay, Life and Death of the Zeppelin. Yep. Of course, they bombarded uh, Paris and London. Heard about the facial uh, disfiguration. Yep, they're known as broken faces. Yep, it's definitely something new to them. I mean, of course, like you know, war injuries. Uh, like you know, it's like, oh, that's nothing. But actually, this is worse than the Civil War, like in the Uni United States and the Franco-Prussian War. Other side. Damn it, other side. You know what? Okay, good. He's turning away. Walt could have done a better job. Okay. Oh, man. Yeah. Why can't get. Th oh, shit. Yeah, that's a bad idea. Okay, Walt. I'm going to need you to, like, uh, get the uh, lever. The handle. Yeah, at least uh, you don't weigh as much as I, as Anna. Okay, come on, come on, Walt. Yeah, good. Come on, don't want you to like you know, get burned. Okay. Okay, let's get in there. All right. You know, we got like you know broken pistol. It's all in, in pieces. Yeah, apparently like I have to do something to get Carl out. And no, it's not Coral. It's not Coral from The Walking Dead. Okay, I really, really. Oh crap. 
Hey, Walt. Go give me a, like, that shit. Good. Good, 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 Walt. Good. Hey, 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 Walt. Don't, don't be like that. Come on. Yes, thank you. Okay. Now, let's uh, head up. And, of course, we are going to use the ladder. Up we go. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah, it's destabilizing. Destabilizing. Okay, I gotta throw... Yeah, that's what I gotta do. Okay. Oh, man. Okay, then. Let's, uh... Let's help out Carl. Okay. Okay, well, come on. There we go. Yes! Good Carl. I mean, good, uh... Like, you know, Walt. Okay. Good, 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 good. Of course, Carl needs, uh... Like, aid. Alright, let's do this. I hope that this one isn't too quick. Yeah, yeah, it's getting quicker right now. Here we go. Oh, wow. Yeah, it is getting faster. Oh, here we go. Oh, man, that was close. Of course, he's asking, like, for the father. That stupid Von Dorf, like, is getting away. Oh, crap, Carl. Yeah. Yo, go get, like, Emil and Freddy. Okay, everyone, that concludes uh, today's episode. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share. Like, leave this video in there, other my works. And uh, see you in the next episode, episode 325. And, uh... Until then, see you next time. Bid y'all adieu. Peace out. I love you all.